Hi, everyone. Welcome to another iPhone app review on the digitallifestyle.tv. Today, we're taking a look at Hotel Mogul for the iPhone and iPod Touch. Essentially, Hotel Mogul plays like something like, let's say, Sim City. And as the name implies, you are running a series of hotels. You build them up over time. You have certain goals on each level regarding uh, income and uh, the star level of your resorts and so forth as you go along. Now, when you first play the game, you have an option to do a tutorial. I'd highly suggest you do that because it does give you uh, a real overview of everything you need to know to move forward with the game. So in this particular level, I've got three goals to meet. I have one met so far. I built a statue. That's the, the easy part. Uh, I really enjoy the game. The only thing I don't like a whole lot is the fact that once you reach the goals for this particular level, then this level is over. And I kind of start to, you know, I want to see how my hotels are going to do over even a longer period of time or something like that. But rather than being a single uh, ongoing level, there are several levels with different challenges, which is nice in one regard because it makes it easy to play uh, one level and be done for that day and play another level another day uh, rather than an ongoing story. The graphics are fun. Uh, the challenges you have along the way uh, make it interesting. You have to worry about maintenance and you need to uh, make sure you collect your money from when people have conferences at your hotel. It's a little confusing when you do the tutorial in the first few uh, rounds because they keep talking about resorts, building your resorts when in reality uh, they're campgrounds. But that's just think of it as the lowest level of hotel and you won't be confused at all. It's addictive play, it's fun, SimCity like action on the iPhone in short, manageable bits in Hotel Mogul. For the digitallifestyle.tv, I'm Ryan Ritchie.